So kids have tons of questions, no matter how old they are. And my kids are younger. I have a four month old and almost three year old, and she still asks tons of questions. And Usborn has books to help us answer those questions and how to teach our kids to find the answer themselves. Now we have books that are great for middle school and high school, a lot of our encyclopedia books. I don't have those because I'm not there yet, but we have tons of other books um, in our house that are great for baby up through elementary school, and I'm gonna cover a few of those. So we have some books that are specifically called question answer books, like What's It Like in Space? I don't know. <laughs> this book will help tell you. Um, all the way from, you know, are there animals in space? How big is the moon? Um, how do you get there? What's happening there? Why we need spacesuits? Um, <laughs> this is a book we've covered. Look at, look, I mean, where's Mars? <laughs> Um, what are germs and talks about what those are and the difference between bacteria and viruses and where germs live and how our body um, spreads them and how it prevents against them. What's a potty for? Great for potty training. Another space one, question and answer about space. This one's a little bit older than the um, first questions. So they have different information as well as some overlapping information. This one's geared towards slightly older kids. Um, super, super great book. Um, what are stars? This one's just beautiful. Oh my goodness. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Love that. Let me open it all up. It's hard to do this on a video, but so great. And then there's some books that help us answer questions that aren't specifically these question and answer books. Um, for example, you know, your kid might be like, what color is Viridian? You'd be like, I don't know what color Viridian is, but you could probably find it in here. So this book is not only beautiful um, and have the color wheel, which she loves to play with, but has all of sorts of different colors. And let's see what we can find here. Oh look, there's Viridian. It's a shade of green. Um, and they might ask, going back to space because we love space here in our home, um, have dogs been to space? This isn't specifically a learning book, if that makes sense. It's not, um, you know, sold as an educational book. I mean, books, all books are educational. This is a story book, a picture book, but it is a true story about dogs who went to space. Um, and so it's just a really fun story. Lots of um, great pictures, um, as well as just learning about the two dogs, Russian dogs that went to space. And might have questions about construction sites. My daughter is very into construction. And so this teaches you not only the different um, truck names, which you probably need to be learning from toys and other things, but um, this just has flaps that just show the progress of building a house and building buildings um, and you know how cranes work and all of that. And so, they might have a question about like what building is that or how do they get to the top to put a beam so this again this isn't a specifically like a question answer book but it has answers to questions um same thing with for this lovely guy so they might ask how big is you know a paw print of you know a panda bear or how big is an elephant's toenail and this actually has the life size to scale um, of animals and animal parts so there's a two scale um, toucan toucan beak um, I'm just meant for you to see what you look like with a toucan beak <laughs> um, so lots of things giant squid um, kangaroo ears. Again, not a question answer book, but a book that answers questions. 
And then there's this whole series about Peek Inside, um, Peek Inside Zoo, Peek Inside Animal Homes, whole series about them if you're more interested in these. Um, but again, educational to see. Lots of little flaps to see where animals live and how they live and dig through, dig holes in the ground or make holes in the wood. Um, and explains that in just a really cute, fun, beautiful way. Dinosaurs, something that every kid loves. Again, this book is great for toddlers because who doesn't love dinosaurs? But all the way up, it becomes more educational as they get older. Um, and because it has lots of facts that Sophie enjoys now, but also go over her head. So it's going to be great to see her um, grow with this book. Um, it just like has just some like big beautiful illustrations and facts about dinosaurs. So that was just a little brief summary of some books that um, aren't even designed for like specific, like this isn't a textbook, this isn't a question and answer book, but just how educational our picture books are. Um, and so it's super fun and she's you know, my daughter's learning constantly just by picking up one of these books and enjoys it as entertainment. So, um, just excited for you to get an introduction to these books too.